So now we talk about the panel symbols. And symbols may first sound strange, and we also need to open it because usually it's not open. And to do that, you go to your panel and then click on View and Studio and then Symbols. And then you see your panel here on the right. And now let me show you what a symbol is. When we click here on Create, the group is a large one, so let's better go to another one I have prepared here. And here you see the flower and um, we are now on Create. And you can see here in the Layers palette that there are several layers, which is usually, which is pretty normal for a flower. It consists of several layers. And the great thing about symbols is that when I have several of these, I can synchronize them and uh, change things at once. So let me show you what I mean here. So you see I've just duplicated it with command J and now I have two of them and once again when I open that you see it also has several layers and I now just choose one of them and when I change the color here on that one you see it changes everywhere. And that's a pretty nice thing so if I have a wallpaper or if I have you know, a large document with a pattern uh, without any edges, which shouldn't have any edges and need to be needless. That is pretty awesome because you just change one object and it changes everywhere. It makes your life so much easier. So now let's go back in time in history here and um, go back to where we were and where we started. And I show you the whole document here. And when I now click zoom to fit you can zoom out and you see the whole paper i have chosen here and now you see when i click on that there is just one symbol and it's synchronized so it matches them all and once again i can pick just one leaf here and change that leaf and every it changes everywhere now just click on one of them and go wherever and you see over the whole paper it changes everywhere. That's pretty nice, isn't it? It makes life so much easier when you are designing and you all of a sudden try to change something. And on the top right there's a sync tool and this means it is going to sync over all these little petals. But you can also detach it and um, have, have it done separate. Sure, you can also delete as a symbol and of course you can also rename it.